Are you sick of jumping into a Call of Duty multiplayer game or even a Warzone game and automatically you're getting beamed down by a no recoil hacker? Well guess what in this video today I'm going to be going over how you can get yourself these hacks and basically the direction of where these hacks are coming from so in case you know Activision or Call of Duty want to come in and basically all the directions pointed that way to say this is where all the hacks are coming from but I'm basically just going to be going over the places where all these hacks are coming from so the first thing is a bit costly but it does the job and this first thing is actually called a Cronus Max if you don't know what a Cronus Max in it basically plugs into your console or your controller somewhere in between there there's somewhere like a, a connection to either your console or your controller but what this thing does is you can basically edit the commands of your controller to any command you want so let's say you have a semi-automatic weapon you can put the command in to make that semi-automatic weapon an automatic weapon so if you're running around with a pistol and you know your your trigger finger is getting a bit tired you activate this this mod and basically you can have your pistol as an automatic weapon so that is one way how you can do things. Obviously, this Cronus Max thing you can do other things with, like you can have anti-recoil. There's probably a range of other things which is pretty illegal to do in the gaming industry and if you want to do on public games. But that is one of the things you can get. So this Cronus Max is coming up at around £70 brand new. Obviously, you can probably go to eBay or similar websites and probably get this thing for like £40, £50. So that is the first way how to get yourself a, a type of mod. It's not like a full-on hacking kind of mod. It's just kind of an adaptation to your controller or console. So this next one is actually a website. And this website right here, basically anybody that has hacks or mods goes onto this website. They fill out a post and basically advertise what they can offer. And you can go from as little as getting yourself one camo to getting every single camo in the game or if you wanted all the xp they can do that for you obviously the prices of this one vary because all of these are independent people so some people offer these services for free which are very hard to get and obviously some people are going to be offering these at a more premium rate but obviously these don't just go down to the camos these go down to invincibility invisibility unlimited points unlimited ammo literally anything you want inside of the game these people do it and this is probably the biggest thing which activision and call of duty are, are taking that well they're, they're basically slipping on thin ice right here if they look in a direct straight line all of these will be gone but they're not so this is why people are abusing these mods hacks and glitches and everything in the game because Activision and Call of Duty are not looking in the direct location of where these things are coming from. Obviously, there's going to be hundreds of other websites offering these things. And this is just a sliver of what is out there. But basically, everything that's on this website, pretty much everybody else will be able to do. And it's just mind-blowing how Activision, Call of Duty, Treyarch, Infinity Ward, Raven and Sledgehammer, they miss this. They somehow look past this and think this is okay in the game. Obviously, it's that easy to go to these websites and get yourself something for super cheap. You can ruin the entire game because they are not looking in a straight line. So while these things are out there, you might as well use them. I, I Obviously, I, I'm going against saying use all these hacks and mods in game, but while they're not looking in a straight line, use them. Trust me, use them because... They, they, they just don't care right now. Cold War's broken. Warzone's broken daily. It's either from an infinite stim glitch or an invisibility glitch or something stupid like that. These things are in the game right now because the developers and the owners, they're not looking in the right direction. So, obviously, I condemn against all the attacks and mods and things, but why they're not doing a thing about it? Abuse it. They, they don't care. Why should we care? So obviously this this has gone on to a bit of a rant and a rave um, about you know Call of Duty and Activision not really caring about what they're doing with the games and it is that easy to get these hacks and mods and things. So it's come down to the point of 
I will be leaving the links down in the description below. They don't care about the game, so why should we? So those will be down there for you to uh, go and venture into and have a little look, because it's actually super easy to get your hands on these things. So that is the video today. Um, it started off as a nice happy kind of video, but then it kind of turned into a bit of a sour one. And um, But yeah, they don't care, so why should we? I'll see you guys in the next video.